Hi guys, Rebecca Creates here with the VR for my girl Wanda, who is a day in my world here on YouTube. She's having a birthday challenge and to participate, you need to create an eight and a half by 11, um, a piece, an eight and a half by 11 page with the theme of love or what love means to you. So um, it is a birthday challenge. It's going to be open until April 2nd. So there's still plenty of time to join. She's going to have um, three PayPal prizes. And if you do a VR, it's an extra point. So that's all the giveaway information. Let me show you what I came up with. So I did kind of like a mixed media vibe. At first, I was just thinking, oh, I have to incorporate my Julie Nutting. But I decided to just kind of, I don't know, wing it. So I did the mixed media paint i put a heart down and then i painted like some of my favorite colors with acrylic paint so there's like the aqua the pink um i did white paint splatter on it what else there's like glitter texture paint and it's like a rainbowy gold glitter i love that paint the glitterific i think it's called um what else i did some stamping here i stamped a little baby fox and a mommy fox because for me love of course is being a mom and I have one son so I thought that was perfect I put a little tiny blue heart there and I hand painted this um heart in white acrylic paint it's a little wonky but I think that adds to the cuteness of it because it is handmade right a little Puerto Rico flag the black and white flag for resistance and this really cute brown girl sticker from my stash. I fell in love with it with the little bling. <laughs> so then I added some bling pieces. There's a bow there. This heart patterned washi along the edge on the side. I thought that was cute. And then I think my favorite piece is this little phrase sticker from the Tim Holtz um, small chat, I think it's called. And it says, um, start each day with a grateful heart. So I just love that. It made me think of what love is to me and it made me think of Wanda. Um, there's some bling pieces, some bling trim, but that's how it looks. So on the back, you're supposed to put your information and she also asks for it not to be very dimensional because she wants to um, put holes and then put it into a binder, if I'm not mistaken, that's her plan. So she doesn't want it too layered or dimensional, right? So that's why I didn't layer it up with all my resin pieces <laughs> um yeah but so this is my entry for wanda you guys go and check her channel out she's an awesome crafter she does tons of haul videos she's always searching for the deals and she joins collabs she does she's just she's great so go and check her out if you don't have time to enter her giveaway or just not interested in making um an 8 by 11 portrait like this definitely just go over to her channel and show her some support and subscribe trust me you you will not be disappointed so yeah wanda this will be in the mail to you soon hopefully you like it and uh yeah thanks for watching guys bye